Well, if you've been watching my videos, you saw me and my granddaughter Jayla catch a crawfish out of a hole on a string. Well, this is Asen. Hey, Asen. He wants to see if he can catch a crawfish out, or at least help Papa catch a crawfish. Uh, you can see these things make a big old mound here in Texas. Uh, you know, as I'm saying, crawfish, but actually here in Texas we call them crawdeads. So the first thing we're going to do is I just got an old piece of bacon and I tied it on a string. Got me an old fishing weight and tied on the end of that just to make it sink. Now the idea is when they get them to the top, before they see me, I'm going to grab them with these needle nose pliers. That way they can't drop off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to knock the mound off. Then we're going to pour some water in it. That way it'll fill completely to the top. That way I don't drag him off on the side. Here, what we caught, Asen. Come here. You want to hold him? No. Come here. No. And look at here. Look at here, cameras. There's what you catch out of these old holes. Well, Papa, that's not a crawdad. That's a crab. Yeah. Keep that away from me. I don't like crabs. Come here. No. Come over here. Why? Yeah, and that's how you catch them. That's how you catch crawfish out of a crawfish hole. Look, come did. here, come here, Ace. It did film you. Come over here. Come here, stand by me. No. Come over here. I'm scared. Come here. I'm not going to put him on you. I want to film you. Lobster. Come here. Come here. You can touch him. No. Come up here. Come here. I'm not going to make. Well, if you enjoyed watching us catch a crawfish out of a crawfish hole. Also had was a string and a piece of bacon, a little old weight on it. And that's how you do it here in Texas. Like I say again, that we call these crawdeads here in Texas, not crawfish. Some people call them crawfish, crayfish, mud bugs, crawdeads in Texas. Remember that. If you've had fun watching this, give me a thumbs up. Until next time, see you later.